Hi, I'm Fox. I'm Couch Guy. And you're watching the Two Smart Guys show, where every week we bring you the latest in getting the most out of your technologies, your gadgets. Do you feel like you're being followed? Followed? Well, you have the iPhone. You should be the one being worried. Why should I be worried? Well, have you read the news? Oh, yeah, the news. <laughs> in case you've been living under a rock, if you've had an iPhone that is using, there's an OS on it, uh, your iPhone's following you. Yeah. And it's not just in your pocket. And guess what? It could be sending the data far, far away to this guy. Why? He didn't know what was going on. Yeah, so apparently with iOS 4, they, um, oh. they keep a log of everywhere you go. Hundreds of times a day. And apparently uh, it's been keeping that information, but at... For potentially a year's... Yeah, I can see at least three years back that of my personal information. Which <laughs> is very interesting in case you're ever subpoenaed. Yeah, uh, where were you on the date of? <laughs> yeah, well, no, this is a legitimate, you know, <laughs> this is weird stuff. Like, how much back information do you need? They say they didn't know. They say they're not keeping track of it, that they only want to have tower locations and Wi-Fi hotspots. We say bull. Well, supposedly it's not going anywhere but your own computer. Supposedly. I don't believe it. He believes it because he worships... <laughs> Apple. But I'm assuming that you don't want to be tracked. I'm assuming that you want your privacy back. I'm assuming you have a solution. Uh, I have a solution, and I also have the method to um, view such data. I like it. So, first of all, if you want to spy on somebody and you have access to their computer. You want to find out where your wife's <laughs> been or you want to find out where your husband's been? Yeah. Guess um, what? You save your stuff on the same computer. You can find out how much time, <laughs> how many times he's been to the strip club. <laughs> and you can find out how many times she's really been shopping. Yeah. So it's real simple applications. There, in our show notes, there's a link to the, both of them. There's a website application if you trust loading your data up to a website. Yeah. Um, well, per personally, not so much. So yeah. um, you can download iPhone Tracker for a Mac and you just... Double click on it and bam, sh pops up with a map and your whole history. Now, we really <laughs> are saying the Mac versions we trust better than some of the other versions right now. It's an open source project. It's been ported all over the place. You can get it for Windows. You can, like I said, there's an online version of it. We're not in such the trusting mood right now. Yeah. And, and there's a big old thing on the website. The, the guys that initially made this for the, yeah. for the Mac that explain how none of their data goes back up. By the way, I want to say and, thanks to the O'Reilly guys who figured this out because this is like the security kind of stuff that's been going on for a while. And these guys are the cool guys that figured this kind of stuff out. Sorry, I had to break that up. Oh, uh, uh, yeah. Props to people who find this kind of stuff out <laughs> is much deserved. And so anyways, Apple says, says they're coming out with a fix whenever. Uh, but if you've been following our shows and you have a jailbroken iPhone, you can go to Cydia and download uh, an app to fix it right now. <laughs> Which is what we want you to do, because there's no reason this stuff should be being tracked on you. So the app is called Un Untrackered, and it lets you clear the cache of locations like to a certain specified time. Untracker D. Untrackered. Yeah. Yeah. Not ED. Untrackered D. <laughs> so um, that's pretty straightforward. Just be wary of where you've been going. <laughs> um, Apple's claims that they're going to have a fix for this and they're only going to keep seven days of your stuff. We suggest you do it yourself. And if you decide you want to take their thing afterwards, that's up to you. Take care of your own data before they download it yeah, and pull and then, it off uh, your system. And then go into iTunes and delete all your backups. <laughs> because you definitely every don't time you, want Yeah, every time you plug stuff. in your, your phone, it backs up and it keeps multiple backups. Yeah. So, so it's not worth having this material. Now, we're not saying that there's anything like that you've done illegally and you want to keep track of, but let's just not give the opportunity to have someone track you. Yeah, who knows, but... I think I want to have a new t-shirt, though. A new t-shirt? Where, where can you get a new t-shirt? I want a t-shirt that says, Tracked by Apple. Tracked by Apple. Steve Jobs is Gollum. Steve Jobs is Precious. watching me from above. <laughs> you know, I want to go to Zazzle.com because you know why? Zazzle's awesome. They have some great t-shirts. If you don't like what you see there and you have a better idea, make your own and then sell it. Yeah, you can make money off of the stuff that you make yourself. And then you buy t-shirts and you know what? You can get 10% off all your orders over 50 bucks, which who doesn't spend 50 bucks every time they look at something anymore? Yeah. Um, the code is two smart guys 4 They changed yeah, every time. Yeah, how it's listed below. <laughs> Just, that's how it works. Um, but Zazzle.com, they're awesome. They make great stuff. Mm -hmm. So um, hopefully, now rumor has it that Android has very, very similar stuff, but they only keep it for so long and then they get rid of it. 
Oh, of course, except for the fact that it's always going up to Google. Yeah, time. well, you know, and no one, I don't trust Google anymore. And, I trust this guy. And, and the truth is, cell, cell calls, every single cellular call, they get your information every time you make one. It's yeah. available for the police, and they, apparently they don't even have to have any kind of a, a mm. warrant or anything. Thank you, Patriot that. Act. Yeah, so um, the real answer is if you don't want to be tracked, don't take your phone with you. <laughs> the, the, well, the catch is they don't keep that data for years and years and years, and it does take some heavy court to get back too far. Yeah. So you having that data tracked inside your own computer or your own phone is just them bypassing court subpoenaed stuff. So let's not let that happen. Yeah. Not that there's anything you have you to know, worry about. You're honest people. If, if you value your privacy, then you'll want to take these You didn't do stuff. anything wrong. No one saw you. Personally, I don't care because um, I obviously live my life in the public. Yeah. So, but. I care because <laughs> I don't have one. <laughs> anyway. All right. So anyways, more shows like this every single week, uh, every Monday, twosmartguys.com. And don't throw out iTunes because you need to subscribe. Yeah. You know, uh, subscribe to the feed. Get it automatically downloaded to your iOS devices. Yeah. And, and then uh, watch them when you're not being tracked. Don't forget to like us on Facebook where we have Facebooky stuff. I want to be liked. <laughs> but we'll see you next time right. because we have more great shows. Bye. This Two Smart Guys production. Subscribe to the feed. That's all, folks. See you all next week. That's all, folks. See you next week.